Hey Wealthy Hustler, I'm going to show you a tool that has personally changed my life and it's called SERP Watcher. SERP Watcher is perfect for you if you're an SEO consultant or just any online entrepreneur in general. Now if you want to get SERP Watcher for 20% off, you can do so by clicking this link here. So let's get started. If you would like to see more money-making news, guides, reviews, and motivation, please subscribe and hit that bell notification so you don't miss any opportunities. To start off, I want to show you the unique and powerful metrics SerpWatcher gives you. Some examples of these metrics are the dominance index and the estimated visitors per month. Now the dominance index is a metric designed by Mangles, which shows you your overall dominance within all of your keywords that you're wanting to rank for. This particular metric has a value from zero to 100. A value 100 means that you fully dominate the organic traffic with your keywords, whereas a value of something like nine means that you have a lot of work to do as far as boosting up within your rankings. This means that you're now able to see how well you're doing with your rankings overall. So you can see that my dominance index goes up and down here. And this is simply because when I put out new content such as this cryptocurrency trading article, I start at rank 35. My rankings were all at a high point but this kind of brought down my metric number here because it's at rank 35. So you can clearly see that before this article, it was at 12.2. Now my dominance index is at 9.1. Now we went over the dominance index metric, but what about the estimated visits per month? It's very important to not leave this disclosed because the estimated visits per month is really great when it comes to managing which traffic you have coming in from your keywords overall. And most importantly, this just isn't an overall metric. Instead, you can look at your keywords individually and find out the estimated visits per month that they're getting. This is awesome because if you're an SEO consultant, you can now give your client an accurate number when it comes to visitors per month they're receiving from your work. Now for you bloggers and online entrepreneurs out there, this data is very useful for you because you can start to scope out which keywords are actually worth it and the ones that you're benefiting from. This is because of the estimated visits per month that you're getting from that keyword. I'm also able to confirm that the data SERP Watcher gives you in terms of estimated visits per month is extremely accurate. I say this because when I go to the Google search console and I go to my keyword CPA method, I'm able to see I get about 60 to 70 visits per month. And as you can see here with the keyword CPA method, it says I get about 71 estimated visits per month. Secondly, I want to talk about some cool features and functionalities that are included within this program. The biggest features and functionalities that I want to talk about are the biggest changes, keyword position flow, keyword position distribution, share report, reports and alerts, and lastly, you have the ability to track your keywords both globally and locally. As we know with any business, it's important to filter out the bad data from the good data. This is so we can improve on what we're struggling with. Well, with the biggest changes feature, SERP Watcher will let you know which keywords have gained and lost rankings with the associated visitors per month change. I love the biggest changes feature so much because it's just all in one organized chart and it really lets you see which keywords that you should focus on. So you can see from here, like CPA method, I went to first position on that. And in result, it has increased my estimated visitors per month up 55. So we can tell that that keyword was actually a really good keyword for us to rank for. Unfortunately, I lost a few positions on my CPA build article. So this allows me to now see what I can do in order to rank for that keyword again. So all in all, the biggest changes feature is actually really positive on both sides. The share reports feature is a really exciting one. You can share your keyword list only or your keyword list plus an overview. And the overview is just everything that you see that I'm hovering with my mouse in the background over here. The keyword list is just this keyword list. So you could share your keyword list with just anybody that you wanna to brag to, but your keyword list plus overview you might wanna be a little more protective over this data because competitors could see this. So SEO professionals could really use this keyword list plus overview and share it with their clients 
Whereas bloggers or just anyone who wants to brag about the rankings can just share this keyword list only. The reports and alerts feature lets you create weekly or monthly reports or customize alerts letting you know if your keyword has entered the top 10, enters the top 100, left the top 10, or left the top 100. And this is very useful information. Also, you can make your report layout the keyword list plus overview or the keyword list only, like you were able to do with the share reports. The keyword position flow feature is awesome because it shows you just a really good graphic appearance of how your keywords are ranking as far as the flow is going. So you can see right here, three of my keywords went up, one went down, and two aren't changed at all. So that's really cool how it graphs all this for you all in one single feature. The keyword position distribution feature is really cool because it gives you a graphical appearance on what your dominance index is. I was able to correlate this to the dominance index because the more that you're ranking on the first part of the search result, you're going to be in the green part right here. The top three to the top one is green. And then down here is the top 10 to top 20 and then the top 100 and down are all in red. And this is just a really good visual representation if you learn best visually. So they really hit the nail on the head on this one. Now the last bit of functionality I wanna talk about is that you have the ability to track your keywords both globally and locally. I can't stress how important this is on rank trackers and I have yet to see it on any other rank tracker but SERP Watcher. Now this tool is great for an SEO consultant because all you need to do is put the location of the business that you're trying to rank for and then the designated keywords for your client. The SERP Watcher will then track all the keyword rankings within that location so you as an SEO can use this tool to track local rankings. On the other hand, SERP Watcher allows any non-local SEO to use this tool. This means if you own a business that's online and you're tracking keywords globally, then you have the ability to do that with SERP Watcher. So this isn't only location specific, but you have the ability to track your keyword rankings globally. So that's awesome too. Now I'd be a fool if I left this out, and that's just the overall appearance and ease of use that we have with SERP Watcher here. I'm sure by just looking at how Mangles has developed SERP Watcher, it really set an impression for you because it did with me. I say this because of all the beautiful charts and data that they give you. Everything is easily readable and formatted just beautifully. Also, because of the design and the color scheme of the site, it really helped me learn how to use this application better. You might think that this is a little over the top, but in reality, the relationship between psychology and user engagement is real. Their appearance and all of what they did to make the site look good, it made me feel really comfortable. I felt confident with it, and the tooltips helped me dramatically with understanding SERP Watcher. Now to help add on to the user friendliness of the program, you can see that SERP Watcher allows user error notifications right here. It lets you know what you did wrong, and so it lets you save some time, and more importantly, if you just put something in such as a protocol when it's calling for a domain, it'll just conveniently change it for you, so that's a great thing too. Now for the pricing, I think it's very reasonable. You guys will love this because I was able to score us all a 20% discount off of the whole Mangles bundle. This discount gives you access to Keyword Finder, which is a great keyword research tool that I use personally just to track keyword competition, and you also get SERP Checker and SERP Watcher. So you can use SERP Watcher, SERP Checker, and Keyword Finder all in one bundle, all for $119.20 a year or $23.20 a month. Now, usually when you buy this package, it's $149.99 a year or $29 per month. So you can see you're getting a pretty good deal with this 20% discount. And I've also heard from the grapevine that Mangles is going to increase their prices. And you can see here it says subscribe before SERP Watcher is launched in July and get it for free. So this means that this price was before Mangles SERP Watcher and it's going to be subject to change which will be around the $30 to $40 mark, which is what I'm guessing. So you guys definitely wanna take advantage of this and get that early bird discount. Now I wish that they could allow you to buy SERP Watcher individually, but as you can see here, 
It's really bundled in with all the other tools such as Keyword Finder and SERP Checker, so it's really understandable why they've bundled this all up. Lastly, I know I said this earlier, but I personally implement SERP Watcher along Keyword Finder in my daily SEO workflow. Now you might be wondering why, but just take a look at my website at wealthyhustler.com. I was able to make my company a success because I now have a bundle of programs that put all the important data I need to see all in a series of graphs and charts. And I also gotta admit, Mangles did a really good job converting me to use SERP Watcher. It just gave me the added value with the estimated visits per month, the dominance index, the biggest changes, and all of the other features and functionality. Just adding all these up, I couldn't help but to choose SERP Watcher over all the other rank trackers. Overall, SERP Watcher allows me to see how well my SEO campaigns are doing and what I need to do in order to get the best results. If you liked this YouTube video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the YouTube channel. For the best money-making news, reviews, tutorials, and motivation, go to wealthyhustler.com. Lastly, if you're a Steemit user, go ahead and follow me. My Steemit link's in the description. As always, live life on your own terms and have a great day.